Welcome back fellow Rams, Easter Candy, and all you other CTV viewers out there for another Ram Entertainment. I'm your host Christian Zamora, and while you were gambling away your financial aid money in Vegas over spring break, I was reading the tabloids and Amanda Bynes Twitter feed just to keep you updated on all the celebrity gossip that went down while you're trying to keep your breakfast down. Here's what you missed over break. It's only a few days into the allergy season, but spring cleaning has already hit celebrity relationships. John Mayer, John Mayer and Katy Perry were the first celeb to call it quits. After the eight-month romance, fireworks seemed to extinguish between the couple. They said what they needed to say, and now the two no longer consider each other's bodies a wonderland. Us Weekly broke the news while giving no reasoning behind the split. Although given John Mayer's track record with women, we're pretty sure we know why they split. Stay strong, Katie. One will learn to love the woman who gave birth to the Oompa Loompa race and lactates whipped cream. In more celebrity breakup news that happened when you were taking body shots off strangers in the Florida Keys, the most successful Keebler elf to ever leave the tree, and by that I mean Ryan Seacrest, called it splits with dancer turned actress Julianne Huff. Seacrest confirmed the split after E! News broke the story sitting around the ill-fated two-year relationship. E! Online said the split was due to their busy conflicting schedules, but Ram Entertainment thinks Julianne was sick of sharing her hair products with Seacrest. It's okay, Ryan. Things are always looking up for you. In other notable celebrity news, worth a quick mention that happened while you're hugging a toilet in Cancun. Brunetti is back to Blondie, a Christina Free The Voice premiered on NBC Monday with Usher and Shakira's truth-telling hips. Beyonce released a new track and nobody bowed down. Selena Gomez and Vanessa Hudgens had a crazier spring break than you. A Veronica Mars movie will grace our unworthy future. Lindsay Lohan is going to rehab for 90 days. That is if she makes it until then. And Justin Timberlake's new album topped the charts with almost 1 million copies sold and made everyone cry with his new music video for his track titled Mirrors. Well, that's all the time we have for today. Until more celebrities remain forever alone, I'm Christian Zamora for Ram Entertainment. Hope you enjoyed the ramen.